my friends, happy day 31 of an A to the day. That was an etude in F major by Droe. It was deceptively difficult and I wish I had more time to record it again, um, but alas, I do not. And in the edition I have, I have this book right here. I don't know if any of you have this, but I found this in my closet here at my parents' house um, when I was going through some of my old music. Um, it says that this one is for evenness. Um, so evenness in the fingers and evenness in the air. I'd say that maybe some of the time my fingers were even, but I think I could have done a better job, especially, I think I was talking about this in Bear Game number three, um, how the pointer finger and the middle finger, they tend to move a lot quicker than some of your other fingers, like your ring finger and your pinkies. Um, so that's just something to be aware of because then it gives you that effect of unevenness. So before I just recorded this, I was filming a video for you guys about open hold flutes versus closed hold flutes. So that's why I was playing on this Trevor James student flute. Um, I'll put the link for this flute in the description box in case you guys are interested in checking it out. It's a really nice student flute. I haven't played on any of their student flutes before. Um, I have a Trevor James alto flute, but it was cool to play on this and I think this would be a great flute for any beginner student. It plays very nicely. The mechanism is super smooth. So keep an eye out for that video. It should be coming within the next week or so. But now I'm off to go teach. I've had a lot of fun connecting with several of you guys who have taken lessons with me ever since I made that announcement. Um, so if you're interested, please check out the link in the description box below for my tone row profile, or you can send me an email at dearkatieflute at gmail.com with the subject lessons. Make sure it says lessons in the subject so I know to check it out. I will see you guys tomorrow for day 32.